Welcome back to my little video series about fancy menu. Today I want to take a look at the random layouts function or the random mode for layouts. So this is basically to randomize parts of layouts. So if you want to let's say um, use multiple backgrounds or randomize backgrounds for menus every time you open the menu a random background gets picked or, um, or you want to use randomized background music or something then you should use the random layouts function and to do this you should start a new layout first so if you want to start with the random background audio now you first need to enable the random mode for your first layout of this group of this um, random group um, to quickly explain what random groups are um, you need one layout per in this in this case one layout per um, random audio or per, per background audio you want to use so you set the first audio to the first layout uh, the second audio to the second layout and so on you need um, one layout per uh, randomized element or whatever you want to randomize in your layout um, or in your menu um, and you need to set a random group ID in this case this is group 1 because yeah we don't have any other uh, random groups yet so we just leave this here this is random group 1 now every um, layout in this random group so every layout for the background audio group needs to have group 1 assigned to them random group 1 um, so let's just add the first audio uh, background audio 1 choose done yeah quickly save it um, random background music 1 uh, yeah okay let's just name it like this and yeah it's saved okay exit confirm uh, yeah now we have the first um, first uh, first layout of this group we need to uh, we need a second layout now uh, we enable the random mode, ag mode again uh, leave this one and add our second audio choose file audio 2 done what's this one okay I remember now <laughs> nice uh, random back Background music. I can't. I can't write. So okay, let's copy this. Done. So now we can check if it works outside of the layout editor. So this one is picked this time. Let's go to the single player menu. Okay, that was unexpected. Uh, let's go to this menu. Okay. Yeah, you see now uh, uh, the the other uh, the other audio is picked. Do it again. This again. This again. Okay. Yeah, you see now um, audio two is picked because every time you open this menu, a random layout of these two gets picked. It's random, so it can happen that the same layout is picked multiple times in a row. Um. So let's create the third layout. Random mode, random group one, and at the third audio, choose file, audio three. Let's not talk about this. <laughs> Save it as layout three and exit. So now I will just use this to reload the menu. It, it works if you do this, but it's faster this way. This one is picked, three is picked, one is picked, three is picked, <laughs> three again, three again, okay, one again, yeah, okay. I just want to show that every layout is picked, uh, it can be picked, but, okay, this was this was the second uh, audio, okay. Now let's, let's do a, a new group, um, new layout. This time we want to um, randomize the background. So let's do a random image, uh, our random, our first random image. Uh, choose file, 
Render background image, image one, done, done. So uh, random mode again, and now we need a new random group because yeah, this is our second a uh, part of the menu we want to randomize. So new random group, random group two, done. Uh, let's save it as random background image one, done exit so now I just need to quickly remove the background of the main layout because in, uh, because otherwise it will overlap with uh, with this image so save it exit okay and now this is the this is the background of the first random layout we just have one so it will this every time uh, new layout random mode random group 2 New, oh, damn. Uh, set background, image, choose image, choose file, image 2, done. And save it again as, whoops, uh, 2, done, exit, confirm. Now we can try if it's randomized. It is. It's, it's, okay, yeah. Um, this works also if I do this. Oh, damn, I should have picked better audios. <laughs> Driving me crazy. Um, yeah, you see it works. So let's add the uh, third layout to this group. Um, random mode on, random group two, done. Set background, animation, choose file, image three, done. This is a, a frame of the cave animation, just yeah, as example. Um, three and exit. So now you will have um, different different elements of these two groups picked every time you reload the menu or you open it again. But this happens every time. So yeah, every time you open this menu, it will pick a new random layout. If you want to pick a layout of one of uh, one of your troops only one time in uh, one time per game session, so in the case of the main menu, the uh, first time you open the uh, you you open this menu, so when the game is getting started, you uh, the 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 system will pick one layout of this group and will stay with this layout. It will not pick another one the next time you open it. It will just use the first pick a layout every time you open it again. This can be useful for things like um, yeah things like like the splash text for example the vanilla splash text is uh, is randomized only the first time you open the menu so this is the same yeah you know the same system um, so let's say we want to uh, do I have any other background or example images? Mm. Okay, let's let's just let's just use the the background image and set this to to only only first time. So if you have a a group you want to have one layout picked at the first time you open this menu. You just need to enable the randomize only first time toggle here. So if you want, uh, if you enable this in one of your layouts of this group, it will, it will enable, uh, will, it will be enabled for the whole group. So yeah, enable it one, and the random group is set to this. Um, now if I save this and exit, so in theory it should just stay at this image now and shouldn't change yeah you see it picked this image the first time this menu got opened and yeah it will stay with this image now you can debug change this if you do this then it should yeah then it should change but this will not happen in uh, 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 if you if you open this this menu in a normal way just if you reload this then it then you can debug change in the background yeah you see, this is basically how to randomize layouts. You can do this with 
with way more than one element per, per layout group. You can, for example, um, make two whole menus, two whole layout menus and just randomize this layout. So if you want to have a a wood, a wood themed menu and a neither themed menu, you just do uh, you just um, add these two layouts to the same random group, and yeah, if you want to uh, have it only uh, have it only changed one time, you open uh, you you have a game session. I can't, I can't. It, no, it doesn't work. Okay, that's so much, so much better. Um, so if you want to randomize, as I as I said, if you want to randomize whole layouts, you just need to add these two layouts or these layouts, these multiple layouts to the same random group and yeah, it will pick a random layout of these. I hope this was at least a bit helpful. I wanted to keep it as short as possible. Yeah, I, I'm not good at this. Um, if something's still unclear or you want to, uh, you want me to explain something different of uh, something, some different thing in Fancy Menu, just write it to the comments and I do my best to make a video and explain it. Thanks for watching, I hope to see you in the next video and bye.